Natalie Byrne is a lifetime member of the world-famous The Actors Studio ran by Al Pacino, Martin Landau, Mark Riddle and Amp. Alec Baldwin. Natalie is considered to be a fast-rising Hollywood actress, dancer, prima ballerina, choreographer, writer, singer, composer and a producer who has a resume that is genuinely unique. Currently Ms. Byrne is partnering up with Millennium Films, Peter Illiff writer and J. Russell director to produce a new motion picture, 59 Rows of Teeth. Natalie's latest work is a film she played the lead in called, The Executioners, directed by Giorgio Serafini produced by Phil Goldfine and Nick Chartier. Voltage the movie will be released theatrically by Lionsgate. Recently starring in, Awaken, Left to Die, a feature film that she created and produced, co-starring Daryl Hannah, Vinnie Jones, Robert Davi and Edward Furlong, Ms. Byrne has also had key roles in, Expendables 3, with Sylvester Stallone, Arnold Schwarzenegger, Antonio Banderas and Harrison Ford where she played the wife of Mel Gibson, she also appears in, Killer Mermaid, Nymph, with Franco Nero, Criminal, with Jordi Mola, Kevin Costner, and Tommy Lee Jones, in, Mechanic Resurrection, with Jason Statham and Jessica Alba and, Mothers and Daughters, starring Sharon Stone, Selma Blair, Courtney Cox, Susan Sarandon. As well as having lead roles in, Carla, Downhill, and, The Ghosts of Garrop, in addition to prominent spots in several other films and TV series. But it's her path to Hollywood that sets her apart from other actresses of her generation. Born in Kiev, Ukraine, Natalie was guided into ballet training from the age of four by her mother, a former ballerina herself. By age eight, she was admitted into the world-renowned Bolshoi Ballet School in Moscow, and in her teens, she moved to London to complete her education at the Royal Ballet School. In a few years she was admitted to the Rambert Dance at the Brunel University where she was keen in learning the art of choreography and modern forms of dance. Natalie had a great dance career performing on top stages all over the world. As a choreographer, Ms. Byrne has worked for numerous theatrical productions as well as putting on her own show for UNESCO called, Astro Ballet. She also funded her own charity organization for environmental awareness where she presented her own ballet called, Stella, which gained the support of Michelle Rodriguez and Owen Wilson. She has also worked with stars such as Paula Abdul, Nelly, Jackson 5, Eros Ramazzotti and Mario. Natalie also appeared as a model on the cover of Calvin Harris' album, Motion. Later she decided to pursue her love of performing and creativity through acting. She moved to Los Angeles and was admitted to the Lee Strasberg Theater Institute in West Hollywood. Later she continued her studies at the renowned Actors Studio moderated by Martin Landau. It was in Los Angeles where Ms. Byrne teamed up with Benny, the Jet, and trained kickboxing, jiu-jitsu, wire work, knife, gun and sword fighting. Because of her international background and ability to speak four languages, not to mention her rather exceptional fighting spirit Natalie caught the attention of casting agents and producers in Hollywood, and she began winning small roles that helped her hone her craft. Natalie now actively produces and stars in independent films. Through her company Seven Heaven Productions she produced her first project, Fallen Angel, she starred as a composer turned heroin addict. The short film won the Merit Award at the 2014 Accolade Competition for the Outstanding Work by a Female Filmmaker. Then, Awaken, Left to Die, which has appeared at more than 20 international film festivals. The film shows her vulnerability and growing confidence as an actress, as well as her ability to take on physical and highly choreographed action film roles. Natalie Byrne won Best Actress Awards for her role as Billy Cope in Awaken at Sunscreen Film Festival and Los Angeles Movie Awards as well as was nominated at NoHo Cinefest. On top of that Awaken won additional 10 awards for Best Feature at different international film festivals. Today Natalie continues her path as an actress and a producer in Hollywood who is currently working on her passion project, Wild Minds, starring Quentin Aaron and will directed by Jan Komasa. The film is about a mental hospital and the young kids struggling to find their purpose and meaning in life. Natalie hopes that this project will be a prime example of what artist movies are like and it will set her apart and give her the right recognition from the usual commercial films she has been involved with in the past.